Welcome to Charles TV. We're going to be making a moist banana bread today. Our ingredients are one and a half cup of all purpose flour, half a cup of brown sugar and white sugar, a stick of butter, four to five large overripe bananas. I, I usually store mine in the freezer, so I just brought it out to tour. That's why it looks like this. Two large eggs, some cinnamon and vanilla for flavor and also baking powder and soda. I also have a, a few uh, chopped pecans here. So let's go ahead and melt our butter. And mash our bananas. You can use a fork. I'm using a masher. Just mash it as smooth, smooth as you can. That's what it looks like. Get a loaf pan. I have one about nine inches by five by two. Just butter your pan lightly. You can also add a little bit of flour just to coat it. Break and whisk your eggs. Now we're going to start to combine. Start with your sugar and your butter and just whisk that together. Whisk until it's kind of combined. Now go ahead and add your mashed bananas. So hold up here guys. The tip I have today for you for making the very best banana bread is to use overly ripe bananas, as black as you can get them. <laughs> yeah, for all my years of making banana bread, this is the secret for a wonderful moist banana bread. Very, very ripe, overly ripe and black. You'll see it's going to make a big difference, guys. So add your bananas. Add your eggs. Now just mix that lightly. Combine your egg with your rest of your ingredients. Now go ahead and add some vanilla extract. About a tablespoon. Now add your dry ingredients, your flour, your baking soda, and your baking powder. As well as your nuts, if you're putting any in the batter. And add a pinch of salt, and also your cinnamon. So I'm not heavy on cinnamon. I like mine light, so I only used about one and a half teaspoon. So just combine that, fold that in, try not to over mix, just fold it in. And now we're going to transfer that into our pan. You can see the kind of consistency I get. Go ahead and just sprinkle a bit of your pecans on top. You can use bananas, you can use whatever you want some raisins, some chocolate, whatever. <laughs> so go ahead and put that in the oven, 325 for about an hour until it comes out clean. You know what I mean, the toothpick check or a utensil check, make sure it comes out clean. Remember it's gonna be moist, so make sure it's dry when you do your testing. And it's ready guys, put it on a cooling rack, let it cool, then you can cut it in slices. Now, I'm kind of impatient guys, <laughs> I'm cutting it up hot. Again, I love my banana bread hot, so I'm not patient enough. It's so moist, it's so delicious, that is so good, look at it, yummy banana bread. That's it for today guys. 
Please like if you enjoyed this and subscribe. Until next time, bye.